How we doing today? My name's Preston Johnson and this is an Adobe Audition tutorial on how to create the phone effect. Today I'm going to show you how to take recorded audio and make it sound like you're talking on the phone. So let's go ahead and get started. Here's a remix I made of Jermaine Dupri and Ludacris' song Welcome to Atlanta. Pay attention to my ad lib in the background. I know about you, but I miss the same trick. Cause that's when I school changed the name Ricks. People from other cities used to drive. If you notice, the background vocals sound like I'm talking on the phone. So let's listen to the track without music. Welcome to Rexburg. Just so all this makes sense, the average human ear picks up between 20 to 20,000 hertz. Phone designers understood that our ears don't really pick up high or really low pitch noises, so the speaker in your phone's earpiece only produces sound in the mid-range. It cuts off those high and low frequencies. So in order to make your voice sound like it does on the phone, you have to cut off the high and low frequencies. So here's how you do it. In the Adobe Audition edit view, be sure to highlight your recorded audio. So you just double click on it. Then you're going to go to Effects, Filters, Graphic Equalizer. In the Graphic Equalizer box, you can go to 20 or 30 bands, but we're just going to make it easy and just do 10 bands. This view of the Graphic Equalizer is just like looking at the face of your stereo, it has a bass dial and a treble dial. The left side are the lower frequencies or the bass. The right side is the treble or the higher frequencies. Over here is the mid-range. So what we're going to do is just remove the, the bass or the lower frequencies just by clicking on those sliders and dragging them down. Then we're going to decrease the treble. At this point we leave the 1 to 8,000 Hertz range we're going to leave that on there and let's just take a listen see what it sounds like. Welcome to Rexburg. Welcome to Rexburg. Okay. Um, so now it sounds like I'm on the phone. So if you like the way it sounds, go ahead and click OK to apply the setting and then put it in where you want it in your in your music. After you've done your work, this is what it can sound like. I know about you, but I miss the same trick. Cause that's when I school changed the name Ricks. People from other cities used to drive for miles. My name's Preston Johnson. I'll continue to bring you more audio editing tutorials. Please subscribe and leave a comment below. If you let me know what kinds of things you'd like to learn about Adobe Audition, I'll be sure to put up more videos. Okay.